the historic significance of the Kampala Amendment is really hard to overstate when you talk about international relations and international law. Where it all starts really is in the United Nations Charter, which has as its very core the prohibition of the illegal use of force by one state against another. And so, in a way, it is amazing that until 2010, we did not have an internationally agreed definition of what it means to commit a crime of aggression. There was no internationally agreed definition of the illegal use of force. And certainly there was no international court that had the power to prosecute those leaders who use the force, use force illegally against other states. So the significance of the Kampala amendments lies in their possibility that they can help enforce the United Nations Charter, that they can help enforce the international collective security system. It's at the very core of the United Nations that one state should not illegally use force against another state. And the Kampala amendments really hold the potential to help us enforce this rule that has been violated so many times in the past.